Hello Luna Child, welcome now to Tuesday. Well, overcast and hyperpensive is my prediction for the Cancers, the lunar child and the mothers of the zodiac. That's because the moon, your ruling planet, is well into Pisces, so this is that philosophical time of the month where you learn from the last 30 days, or you replay old conversations or dialogues in your head, or you read old texts. You're lo emotionally learning, basically. But the trigger today will be the moon crossing over Uranus, Mars, and now Venus that's direct. So what may be triggered is an emotional booby trap, an old emotional booby trap, where you just want to collapse to your knees, where you don't feel strong, and it will be around some sort of faith or philosophy in the world. Can I really believe in this? Can I really believe in that? Can I really believe in him or her? And that's not really where the power is. The universe is unveiling an area where you could theoretically sabotage your life. When we fall into these emotional patterns, what we do is we put out a huge vibrational wave of this negativity. So tomorrow we're set up for what? more negativity and more proof of what we experience today. So the point I think of the moon conjuncting Uranus is to innovate your emotions, to make new choices of how you're gonna to react to a certain stimulus. And when Venus direct, you have the creativity and the love and compassion to do just that. Now, what's tied into this is Saturn retrograde in Virgo, which means as you have this collapse of faith, you may also start to have a bad attitude. And that's what Saturn is working on, is getting rid of Cancer's bad attitudes, their prejudices, they're mind games, so don't let yourself fall into a mind game. By the way, Saturn goes direct May 3rd, so you'll be moving ahead and clearing out mind games, not victim of it at that time. One last thing to point out, the sun in Taurus in chapter one is all about your place in society, your friendships, your social circle, and your social status. So it's very likely that something in your circle of friends or something going on in the world will trigger this little collapse of your faith, your collapse of your belief structure. And if that's the case, also take note. For the next nine days, we're going to be uncovering what's wrong with your certain or your current perspective on your social status. All right, Cancer, that's all I have for Tuesday. I'll see you tomorrow with Shout Out Wednesday. Live, love, be. So